Hi there, YouTube family. It is Joni from Smiling Shrinking, and I'm coming to you guys today on Friday of Memorial Day weekend. And I, I am so excited to get the next three days off work. Yay! And um, I just wanted to do a quick check in, and I have a Stitch Fix box today. I thought that while I still had a little bit of sunlight out here, that I would um, shoot from outside and just do a quick little update. Um, WLSFA is one week away. Yay! Um, again, if you guys are going to San Antonio, please, please, please come up and say hi, introduce yourself. Um, hopefully, I, I know quite a few people that are going and I'm so excited. It's going to be fabulous. So um, my background, yeah, I'm smiling. I'm Joni. Uh, I had duodenal switch surgery um, a year and oh, geez, how long has it been? It'll be two years in August. You do the math. <laughs> Anyways, um. I have lost a hundred and or one hundred. I have lost two hundred and thirty four pounds, two hundred and thirty five pounds. <laughs> and uh, then I had skin surgery in October. That's been about six and a half months ago, where I had all my jiggly bits taken care of and all of my shrinkles. And uh, I just feel fantastic. Life is so good. Um, I'm still, you know, n now the swelling is finally fully down, and uh, I'm starting to be fitting in clothes more regularly. Look how cute this is. <laughs> Sorry, I got all the kitties out playing. Don't drink the pool, weirdo. Oh, kitties are so weird. Anyways, um, th th look how cute this little shirt is. I got this at the Value Village. And I got a whole bunch of shirts. They're really cute. Um, excuse the mess. We're still working on the backyard. Um, but I, have, I got 15 shirts. 15 shirts and... A couple of those were sweaters because I'm getting cardigans because it's still cold in the mornings so that I can do little layers. Um, but I got 15 shirts for $49 and that includes sales tax because my brother works for their corporate thing and we got a little family discount. But still, isn't that amazing? Anyways, and then my friend Dara totally got me a hookup. Um, her, she and her mom got me a bunch of cute bottoms. Here, let me stand up and show you. Because these bottoms I'm wearing. Oh, sorry. Sorry for seasickness. <laughs> My daughter and her friend nerds are watching me talk to you guys. <laughs> Anyways, I want to show you my pants. Look how cute. <laughs> Anyways, they're so cute. <laughs> sorry. Anyways, I got these cute pants from Dara and some shirts. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to go get my stitch fix on, so I'm probably going to move inside so that you guys can see everything. Anyways, my little smarty pants daughter, Jordan. Mm. Ooh, speaking of my smarty pants daughter, Jordan, I actually have a comparison picture of before and now um, Mother's Day edition. And it was actually at one of my very biggest. So um, I, I'll slip that in here and then I'll go and get my stitch fix stuff ready. So I'll talk to you in a minute. Okay, you guys. Hi, I'm back. Um, so today is a stitch fix day. Sorry about my daughter. Um, I am filming today from my closet. I have a, a shocking amount of pink and coral. I think you can see. Anyway, so today is stitch fix day. And as all of you know, I'm sure how stitch fix works. You pay a styling fee. It's usually $20. Um, I actually have a style pass, which means that I have styling fees free for the rest of the year. It cost me $49 and I got $49 off my first purchase after I did that. So I still right now have, I think like seven bucks on the account and I haven't been great about showing you all of my stitch fix, 
stitch fixes, um, mostly um, because it was tax season, it was busy, it's finally not so busy, and I just want to be honest, you guys, I did peek online to see what was going to be happening on this fix to make sure um, what everything looked like. So anyways, if you would ever like to give it a try, and I hope that you would, because it is really fun. Um, I'm going to leave a link down below that is a code that is individual for me. And if you want to try it, you can try it risk-free. I do get a little bit of a credit that it would go towards any future purchases. But um, again, I think you should do it for yourself. I like that you can do it risk-free. They do come up with some things that are just really unusual, very beautiful. Um, the quality so far has been excellent, and I absolutely love some of the pieces that I've gotten from Stitch Fix. Anyways, this bundle is a little bundle, and I think they call it a bundle, and you guys know how that works. This is the return envelope. In case I shouldn't love everything, I could send it back. Um, a little advertisement for Father's Day, and I am thinking about doing that for my husband. Anyway. He dresses beautifully all the time. And my stylist note, I like to wait till the end to look at the prices and the styling notes because um, I don't want to be influenced by the price. And I don't know what the prices are. I do know the basics of what they are. Although, I don't know if you guys know this, that when you see the pictures, they don't always do them justice. Most of the time, they are much cuter in person. <laughs> I have to pause. I'm so sorry. But uh, let me grab my camera. <laughs> Look in the window. I got a little creeper out here. Let me come. What are you looking at, Prince? <laughs> He's watching. He climbs up on the roof and tries to get in through the window. Sorry about that. Anyways, okay. So this is the first time I have ever gotten a Stitch Fix box that has an accessory. And the reason for that is I'd always told him I wasn't interested because um, I don't wear a lot. You guys always see me wearing my little sparkly necklace. Um, this is what's called a, sorry, I know this is off topic, but this is called a ginger snap. And it's so pretty. Let me see if I can get up close enough that you can see it. And it's so sparkly. I wish I could get the light to shine on it. Anyways, this little piece that goes in the middle is called a snap. And it just literally snaps on. And so some, I have all different colors and stuff, although this is really one of my favorites. And I have one in turquoise that is probably, these are my two favorites. And this was a gift from my sister-in-law. And so that's pretty much all I wear. That and my, I wear rings always. And look at how cute my fingernails are, you guys. Can you see how pretty they are? It's like my little girls are going to love these. And they did. Anyways, back to Stitch Fix. Let's, sorry about that. So this time... I did get a piece of jewelry, and that was the first time I've ever done that, um, and I thought it was quite lovely. So let me, oh, wow, I can't, this is how, this is why you have to just wait and see what it looks like, because this is actually quite a bit bigger than I would have thought. When I looked at it online, it looked like it was going to be very dainty. It's a half, called a half moon. Anyways, I thought it was going to be much more, much smaller. Let me go, let me move this one out of the way. And see, that is pretty. Let me go like that. I think that is lovely. It's just, um, it's a lot longer than I would have thought. And sorry, my shirt is a little bit busy. Let me see if I move this and put just the white, if you could see it a little bit better. <laughs> Anyways, it's quite pretty. I wonder, and I'm going to find out right now, if this is something... Oh, it is. You can um, adjust it. Can you see this? So it looks like if you pull the strings, it should make the necklace shorter, which I would like because I... That's one of the things I love so much about this necklace is I can change it from short up here all the way down and it can go all the way down to here. I just like it better when it shows up on my skin. Anyways, again, this is the half moon. I'll read the rest later and I'm going to open up the bundles. So let me put this back in the box. I wish I knew how to edit so you wouldn't have to wait so long while I'm doing things like this, but y'all know I am not good at this. Okay, so here is my bundle. Got some beautiful colors. 
I think I'm going to start on this end because from least favorite coming forward. So this first pair are a pair of Chino Capris. And they're kind of in this olive green. Yeah. Olive by STS Blue is the name. And it's just a pair of cute little capris. I don't own anything this color, as you can see behind me. My closet is pretty much, I've got a little bit of black, a little bit of white, but mostly everything is turquoise or coral or pink or yellow because I prefer colors. I do have some quite a few pairs of white bottoms because I like white shorts. I have denim shorts, but I, I will give these a try. They feel like really good quality and I will give them a shot. Now this I think is very darling. Um, it is a little dress and it is stretchy and the fabric is very soft and I love florals. Now this is a little bit more understated than I normally would choose the colors. The they're more like in the mustardy and yellowy. So I'm not, you know, even as I'm looking the other ones, they're, um, to me, these colors look more like fall, fall florals. And even this one here, which is pretty, it's a cute little uh, tank top and it does a crisscross in the front and it's shorter in the front and longer in the back. I do think it's pretty, but again, it's more of like a mustard yellow. I don't know if it's showing, it actually looks brighter on the camera than it is in person. And so um, I do like the cut of it. We'll see, we'll see how it looks. Um, and this last one, I do, again, still kind of a mustard yellow and um, purple, but this one does have some coral, which I and you know that. And look at how darling this has such a pretty, pretty um, shoulder line, which is like a crochet. And I am a fan of that. And I do like this neckline. So I'm trying this one looks cute on. So I am going to pause for a minute, throw some clothes on. I'm going to move my little stool out of the way and I will start the try on. Thank you. Okay, so here are the pants, the capri pants. Um, I already told you guys I wasn't wild about the color. But more than that, I, I just don't think they look cute at all. I think I look like I have, um, uh, what's the word, <laughs> and the shirt. I think the shirt is too big, like even with the uh, strapless bra. I'm still just falling out of it and it's, I think it's just too big. <laughs> it's ill fitted. Anyways, um, but these, show, these pants, if, let me show you, I've got all kinds of room and in the back and then from the side, they look like, uh, like, <laughs> like circus pants. You know how the the big, I don't know. I just don't think those look very cute. I mean, together they look all right. They just don't seem like they're fitted very well. So let me try on the other shirt. Okay. Um, here is the second shirt, which I do think looks better than that first one. And I really, really hated those pants. So I put on the cute little pants I had on earlier today. And they're still, you know, they're a little baggy. They're not too tight. Um, but I think it's weird because it's kind of tight through the boobs, but I don't think it looks bad. And I put, this is with my strapless bra again. Yeah, look, I'm working out. Can you tell? <laughs> Anyways, um, I think it would make me want to do the semi-tuck in the front. So let me see if I did a little twist and tuck if I would like that even better. I'm not trying to mess up their shirt. And then I kind of can still leave it out in the back. Anyways, so let me. Oh, I wanted to look at the detail. Let me get a little closer so I could see it later too. Anyways, I think that is a cute one. I think this one is a keeper. Anyways, let me try on, let me try on the dress and I will be right back.
<laughs> okay, you guys, here is the other dress. Can I just say, I um, <laughs> changed, and I, I had on my strapless bra from earlier, and I think it's way too <laughs> thin. It, it, my nipples are like, hi! <laughs> So I changed back into a little padded one, which I think is a little better coverage. Anyways, and I was walking back in to start filming and my husband goes, don't try on the grandma jeans. And I said, grandma jeans, what are you talking about? He said, those ones you had on at first, they look like grandma jeans. <laughs> Anyways, okay, you guys, here is the last dress. Um, it's, my husband said, I think it needs a belt. And he could be right. I mean, it's just, I don't know if that's just the style. Either that or I need some go-go boots. I can't decide which. <laughs> it's super comfortable. It feels like I'm wearing a nightgown. Um, the print is actually prettier on than I think I originally thought it was. Um, again, with the necklace, I think I would probably wear it um, up or down or maybe even just not at all. I could try back on that. Uh, no, that other one, it's a little weird. <laughs> it's just too big and bulky. Um, anyways, so I do like the three quarter length sleeve. I found with my skinny little arms that I either like no sleeve at all or just barely a cap sleeve or a three quarter length. I, uh, I think my arms look better and I'm trying to work out and make them a little bit buffer, but I know they are still quite small. Anyway, so again, here's the last dress. I think it is cute. Um, this one, I think it'll just depend on the price. So I am leaning definitely. I love the little shirt with the coral uh, flowers on it. And this one I like okay, but the rest, not real wild about. And I think they're all going to be going back, but we'll look and see the prices. So I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back in my own clothes. Um, I think that because I have, sorry, let me, uh, Scoot down. I think because I have gotten some really nice pieces at really reasonable prices that I think that it has made me want to be more picky with which Stitch Fix pieces that I pick up. Um, I'm saying that because I, you know, I was able to find some really cute um, pieces, some really, for some really good prices. And, and before I was having trouble because I had winter pieces thanks to my friend Kristen and thanks to my friend Dara um, I had some winter pieces and then thanks to Stitch Fix I had some great summer pieces and then my my bestie Chris also did some shopping and got me some other cute pieces and so I had like really hot weather and I had cold weather I just didn't have things like this that are kind of a medium um, you know where it's you know it's a nice short sleeve shirt but because it's still cold in the morning you know, just kind of layers of, of different things. So I think that I'm going to look at the prices and decide what I'm going to get, but I think it's just going to be the one shirt today. I, I don't love the other ones. Like I loved the other pieces that I've been getting and I'm just going to start and keep continue to just be a little bit picky. Anyways, um, I am going to wrap up this video. Um, oh, I'll, how about I'll just leave the prices in the description box down below and again I will leave a code if you would like to try Stitch Fix and um, that's about it WLSFA one week away and um, I have my beautiful dress I think if you follow me on Instagram you would see that I uh, went shopping a couple weeks ago and found my beautiful dress for the sparkle and shine gala I cannot wait to wear it it's so beautiful it makes me feel like a movie star I cannot wait um, I just don't know how I'm going to pack it and get it to San Antonio without wrinkles. <laughs> but anyways, so um, doing great. Nice to see everybody. Did I tell you what my weight was this morning? It was 144. So weird. So weird. Anyways, um, I will talk to you all later. Mwah! See you next week. Okay, you guys, um, I wanted to let you guys know that I am actually going to end up sending all five of the um, items back. I watched the video back, um, even though I did like the crochet on the back, I did like the white top 
that when I watched it back, it actually has a pretty big gap in the middle on my boobs <laughs> because of the, just the, the way my boobs are. It, it makes them look really busty, like it's busting out. And um, I didn't like that. I did retry back on that purple dress and I actually liked it the best of all of them after watching it back. However, it was $54 and I just don't think that I would wear it enough to justify paying $54. You know, um, I think if you are a regular watcher, you probably saw when I tried on that pink dress from Stitch Fix before I went to Cancun. I loved it so much instantly. I think I uh, didn't care what the price was that I decided that yes, I wanted it and I have worn that dress. I wore it in Cancun. I've worn it for daycare. I just wear it to a baby shower. Um, I feel so cute in it that I'm so happy that I have it. And I think I need to just stick to the pieces that make me feel like that. So anyways, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up. Thank you so much for watching. Again, I'm going to leave a code down below if you'd like to give it a shot and I will film the next time it comes. Um, if you're going to WLSFA, I will see you next week. And in the meantime, have a great weekend. Bye.